We are yet to establish a number of dead or injured, which we fear uh, may well be in the hundreds. Uh, medical facilities have been inundated with injured. There is no doubt that we are facing a major humanitarian assistance uh, emergency and that a major relief effort will be uh, required. Many of our UN colleagues on the ground, including my special representative in Haiti, Mr. Anabi, and his deputy, Mr. Da Costa, are as yet unaccounted for. So we are, we are just all here together to show that we are all united, because as you know, in Haiti, there was a very important mission, peacekeeping mission minister, but also many other UN agencies. Some uh, people have been extracted out of the building, but only less than 10 for the time being, some dead, some alive. Uh, so we don't know for the time being the fate of the other, but of course we are extremely, extremely concerned. Commander uh, General Toro. Many important buildings in Port-au-Prince have collapsed and are very are damaged, including the uh, National Palace, uh, the National Assembly Building, the Montana Hotel, the our own headquarters in uh, Christopher Hotel, uh, many, many ministries also, many private residences and buildings. So uh, you can understand, I mean, the, the situation, the rubble on the streets, so access to many of these places is, uh, is really, really difficult. Staff members of WFP and UNICEF, if you can give similar numbers to what... To well, as what far as we know, um, obviously a lot of buildings were damaged, but uh, our information suggests that the, 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 for the most part the staff at WFP, UNICEF, WHO, other humanitarian organizations, including OCHA, uh, my own uh, staff, they're, they're, they're okay, they're safe. Uh, as, I mean, not, not necessarily all of them, but, but in general, uh, reasonably intact. So we can kickstart the operations by the people we already have on the ground, as well as, of course, what we'll be bringing in from outside. I think the World Food Program are already sending in 90 metric tons of high energy biscuits to, to start the process off. Uh, the patient flow, just give you an idea of what we do each day. Yes, what we did? Yes, 